हेलो डियर स्टूडेंट्स टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस विलियम वर्स वर्स फेमस पोएम वी आर सेवन विलियम वर्स वर्स एज यू नो इज अ सेलिब्रेटेड रोमांटिक पोइट दिस पोएम वी आर सेवन वाज इंक्लूडेड इन हिज वॉल्यूम ऑफ पोएम्स लिरिकल बैलेट्स that was published in the year 1798 in collaboration with Coleridge who is also a great poet this poem is a kind of discussion between the poet and a little girl who is just 8 years old and uh, she is uh, an innocent loving carefree child and the poem seems to be a very simple and easy description of this little girl but if we see uh, if we see if we look into it this poem contains a deep message of life as well wordsworth has written it at a place that the idea of this poem we are seven came to him while he was traveling across england in october 1793 in the course of his travel he happens to reach a place called goodrich castle and here he meets this little girl who served as a model for this poem we are seven i repeat the name of the place where he met this little girl the name is goodrich castle g o o d r i c h goodrich castle c a s t l e castle goodrich castle was the place where he met this little girl in 1793 you can mention this fact in the footnotes after your explanations and it will certainly add some more mark to your uh, explanation uh, the question of uh, this explanation this poem is written in the ballad form it is a ballad this fact also you can mention in the notes given after uh, your explanation so this poem we are seven is written uh, or we can say divided into 17 stanzas i will discuss all these stanzas one by one and uh, i'll be making separate videos for each stanza Uh, for the convenience of the students so in this uh, first part of this uh, series of we are seven poem i'll be discussing the first stanza that is i will read out a simple child that lightly draws its breath and feels its life in every limb what should it know of डेथ इस स्टेंजा में जो पोइट हैं विलियम वर्सफर्थ ही इज टॉकिंग टू दिस लिटिल गर्ल ऑफ एट ईयर्स एंड ही हैज़ नॉट मैंशनड हर नेम उसका नाम उन्होंने मैंशन नहीं किया है और वो लिखते हैं अ सिंपल चाइल्ड अ सिंपल एंड इनोसेंट चाइल्ड ऑफ एट ईयर्स और आगे डिस्क्रिप्शन देते हैं कैसी है वो बच्ची दैट लाइटली ड्रॉज इट्स ब्रेथ वो जेंटली ब्रीथ्स बहुत सॉफ्ट है एक आठ साल का बच्चा जैसा हो सकता है सॉफ्ट एंड इनोसेंट एंड प्लेजेंट उस तरह की ये बच्ची है एंड फील्स इट्स लाइफ इन एवरी लिम इट सीम्स शी इज़ फुल ऑफ लाइफ जीवन के लिए बहुत एक उत्साह उमंग खुशी उसके अंदर दिखाई देती है शी इज़ 
very happy she is a blithe spirit this word blithe we have read it to a skylar written by pb shelley so you can use it here as well so this little child of 8 years is full of life she is a happy spirit she is full of life and the poet is wondering what should it know of that death ye bachchi मृत्यु के बारे में क्या जानती होगी ये बच्चों ये कविता है छोटी सी सिंपल छोटी तो नहीं है इट इज़ सेवेंटीन स्टैंडा स्टैंडा लॉन्ग पोएम बट इट इज़ अ पोएम विच इज़ अ वेरी सिंपल पोएम एंड इट सीम्स दैट इट इट इज़ यू नो जस्ट अ सिंपल डिस्क्रिप्शन ऑफ अ चाइल्ड बट इट इट गिव्स अ डीप मीनिंग hidden in the minds of small children we can say so here the poet is saying what should it know of death ye bachchi mrityu ke bare mein kya janti hogi because in this poem we are seven the title of the poem is we are seven hum saath hain is kavita mein hum aage dekhenge ki kavi jo hain he questions this little girl how many siblings she is how many siblings she has kitne bhai behan uske siblings yani bhai behan dono hi included hote hain to uske kitne bhai behan hai and she answers we are seven while two of her siblings are dead uske do bhai behan ek behan aur ek bhai ki mrityu ho chuki hai still she answers that we are seven we are seven siblings she even now she includes those two dead siblings of her as part of her family so this is a long discussion a long discussion goes on between this uh, between the poet and this little girl and we will see hum aage dekhenge ki is kaise wo bachchi uh, she feels associated and part of those uh, dead siblings unke sath kis tarah ka judav wo mehsoos करती है तो इसको अभी हम आगे कंटिन्यू करेंगे इन द नेक्स्ट स्टैंडा आई डिस्कस स्टैंडा नंबर टू थैंक यू